Alright, you know the drill. We need calm. The world so needs big. Him. She's the only one he'll communicate with. I can use it. Oh shit. It's Godzilla. Oh, this song's so much better than the other one. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> he lost. Oh my god. Mecha Godzilla again. Broke the chains. <laughs> no, 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 please don't be it. No. Oh, I need more. Oh, and that song was so beautiful with it. Oh, man. Okay, all right. I tried to refrain myself from pausing because I was going to pause almost right away <laughs> when Kong was um, hitting the chain right here. That That shot will never get old. That shot will never get fucking old. It is so beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. This isn't a battle. It's not. Somehow they, they will make it a fight, but Godzilla will eradicate the monkey. Wow, okay, so not too much to break down. Um, I guess we'll just have to look individually. That shot of him breathing the atomic breath looks so good. I'm so glad they updated it from 2014 because I never really liked the little 2014 water gun, you know, kind of just stream of fire. It was cool how um, his spines lit up in the bag, but then King of the Monsters definitely fixed that. That was one thing King of the Monsters did right. And it looks like in this one, it's a lot better too as well. CG's definitely better. Oh my god, he just fucking smacks him down like nothing. Look at Tail Whip. It looks like there are two different scenes though. Look at that, because it's night, and then it's kind of day. Yeah, that's got to be like two different days. This has got to be like when they're fighting Mecha Godzilla right now during the day. That's what I think. So Godzilla and Kong will fight in Hong Kong at night, you know until eventually Mechagodzilla will come out. That's where that, that shot of him in the beginning flying over the city causing chaos. I think that's where it's gonna come in and then two of the team him up, Batman v Superman style. <gasps> yo, 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 wait, whoa, 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 what? Hang on. Ah, they thought I wouldn't fucking notice. Okay, maybe I was completely wrong. Okay, so Godzilla's obviously attacking King Kong there, but look at this one right here. What are they looking at? <laughs> This has got to be after their fight at night. This has to be like, like towards the end of their fight at night because Godzilla is right here on the left and Kong's right there, but they're looking at something. Unless King Kong actually just mi missed like an axe swing and just hit a building. But I'm just laying that out there. This is probably when they start teaming up. If not, then I mean, yeah, that's probably most likely what happened. Already, the cinematography is so much better. That's that's what we need. That is, that is what the franchise desperately needed was 2014 style Pacific Rim style you know cin cinematography where it's literally just like it's wide shots you know it's not just these awful shitty close-ups of the, the monsters you know these monsters are 300 feet plus so of course you, you want to see the battle when it's a wider shot you know to get really that, that full scale of it because look at that look how big these guys are <laughs> all those cars down there those people are dead they're done they're gone and then we can see all of it though especially with this beautiful neon lighting of Hong Kong yeah, okay, well, in the, yeah, okay, alright. In this shot, I guess, maybe they're not teaming up at this moment. Um, or maybe they are, but I think most likely Kong just missed, missed like, a swing of his, uh, Stormbreaker. Went right into that building, and then Godzilla kind of dodged it, or maybe, like, a little shockwave happened. But th those people are gonna die, too. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why the fuck they didn't evacuate sooner. But this shot right here is pretty sweet, too. So, yeah, this is probably after he goes to that little aircraft carrier, or the, the battleship. Goes right through it like butter, and he probably sinks under the water. Kong's like, well, where the fuck did you go? Come fight me. Boom! Flips the whole aircraft carrier. Kong's underwater, and then he's got to make it to another boat, which I think he does later on in the trailer. It'd be so funny if he just went right through it, back in the water, and Godzilla just drowns him. End of the movie. Alright, guys, tell me what you guys think down in the comments below. That was about it. Um, there's really not much else to add for this input right now. Really good trailer. Uh, music choice is a lot better, like I said. Definitely more impactful. I guess emotional. As emotional as you can get for a giant monkey fighting a giant lizard. But anyways, thank you guys for watching and have a good one.